Hello, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, my fellow creative designers and content creators. Welcome once again to another exciting episode on this channel. And in today's episode, we are going to do a Photoshop quick tips and tricks. We are going to treat how to design this glass text effect in Photoshop. So please, if this seems to be interesting to you, kindly stick around and let's go through the tutorials one after the other and then again if this is your first time you are coming across this channel i'll urge you to subscribe like share comment and let's grow the channel together and please if you're already a subscriber thank you very much for sticking around to watch this tutorial and trust me i have a lot of tutorials in which you can learn from including flyers logo design birthday flyers invitation cards call cards and name them everything i have them on my channel and if you are a beginner as well I have a Photoshop course in which you can stick on my channel. Just go through introduction to Photoshop part one, two, and three, and start practicing something and learn Photoshop. And if you have any issues, you can link me up on my social media handles and let me help you. Let me know how this video will help you all. Let me know how this video is helping you in any way or any other means run so without wasting your time control and to open a new document and let's set up the background so we are going to set 1920 by 1080 and call it a glass text effect good so the heading is set glass text effect and then everything is okay so you click on create and then you have a nice background like this for me and then i'm going to pick this side let me pick a solid color and then pick color black yes i'll pick Color black and I'll click on OK and then I'll type my text. Yes, I'll type my text. So the text I'll type is let's say let me use a text like so I'll use a text like slide. Yes, let me just double click here and, and press slide. The type slide. Good. I'll test them like this. The test is ready. Go to character panel and then test set here to maybe 50 and then press enter and then close here to zero. And then still increase this side to maybe 100. Let's see. That's awesome. That's awesome. I'll scale it up like this. Yeah, so maybe you might change the test and then set it welcome. Yes, let's use welcome. Good. Yes, I'm sure welcome because the other tutorials I use um, um, slider, so I am trying to change the test and use a different test at all so let me change the font and you can use any font at all and let's set here to 100 and see and 100 to is is some way somehow but i'm sure let's guess okay um and i think this one too we must use this font let's use this one and make that heavy and let's use heavy and uh, yes let's scale it up control t to scale it up and scale it up nicely like this awesome 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 let's see the size let's see if you can use 200 yeah i'm sure 200 is okay all right all right all right all right control a to center and align guys this is a step-by-step -step tutorial so even if the tutorial is long it's part of the photoshop quick tips and tricks so please stick around i just want to do it a step by step so that even a beginner who is practicing photoshop for the first time can watch this tutorial and practice and understand without any problem that is it that is it yes that is all about what this channel is capable of doing we are we aim at helping everybody to learn everybody irrespective of whoever you are whether you are a beginner or whatever we just we just don't want to design for pro people only we are practicing or we are learning it for beginners and professionals as well so that is it then the next thing is that you go to this side and then go to blending option and then set here to zero third opacity set it to zero good and then go to bevel and emboss good bevel and emboss and then set this side to pillow emboss set this uh, techniques to softer set this side depth to 100 and then set here to up and then set the scale to 25 set softer to soften to zero and then angle to 90 check this side and then come and click on 30 here and then this glass contour set the glass contour to this side and then and then height mode high uh, highlight mode sorry highlight mode set it to linear dodge add and then opacity set it to 80 
and then uh, shadow set it to um, uh, multiply set here to multiply and then set this side to color white always set this side to color white and then here to 80 all right and then this side set it to black color black here and then you set here to 10 good good then that's done you go to this uh, 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 sorry uh, uh, inner glow yes let's set inner glow yes inner glow you set inner glow then set the blending option to screen set opacity to 15 set this side to set this side double click here and pick color white and then click on ok and just leave here like that and then click on here and then set techniques to softer set opacity zero sorry choke zero and then set size to seven and then set contour to this set contour to this and then you come and set range to 50 set jota to zero and then that is okay now we go back to this and then you set um, drop shadow let's add drop shadow to it to make it look realistic so drop shadow then set here to multiply set opacity to 20 set angle to 90 and then set here distance to 15 1 5 spread to 0 and then size to 45 okay so the size is 45 and then come and set the contour contour to this side yes the last one and then come and set noise to zero and then that is okay that is okay that's okay so you see everything is okay so i click on okay here and then this our glass text effect is set nicely glass text effect nicely then you can come back and come and change the solid color that is the background color and then set it to any color at all of your choice yes set it to any color at all of your choice and this is awesome this is awesome just set the colors to any color of your choice and get this awesome thing or awesome design that you are looking for i'm sure maybe let's try and get an awesome color and this is not bad at all or this is not bad at all let's set let's set more colors guys let's set more colors let's set more colors let's set more colors and i think this is okay this is okay so you click on okay and then you can come back to the main text and edit them you can come back to the main text and then do just double click this side and then write your text over there come and double click here and write good and that is it just control d to select it and then scale it up like this and guys you have this your nice glass text effect design in photoshop so please this is how to create a glass text effect in photoshop this is part of the photoshop quick tips and tricks that we have embarked on for some time now so please if this is your first time coming across this channel please stick around we have a lot of tutorials in which you can learn together i love you and i'll see you in the next tutorial bye for now